Hey, sorry for that. Seems like we meet the Facebook and the Twitch. Oh, I'm right. so sorry. Well, you still here? Hang with us. <laughs> okay. So let's do it. I have the couple of nails right here. And with the um, liquid gun powders, ombres, I did it the other day. So I'm going to do what I'm going to do. I'm going to just put the um, matte top coat on, finish, and here for 30 seconds. Because we're going to do some designs on it. Okay. Okay. Let's do some things cool down. Alrighty. So we're going to do weaver and some glitter. What's up? What's up? Like no. Stuff. Hey, which color do you want? One color. Which one? Can I get all? That's a lot. Let's see if I can get some out. Just do one now and see what's up with this. I'm so excited. Let's see which one we're gonna do. There's a lot of them. I'll get a couple of them out and then see. I'm gonna do these three colors. The three colors. Okay, let me get the the crystal. One second. This is a what I got on my, but your kids might get something totally different because this is a treasure box. It's not like a sub box. So I'm just gonna use these three color and see what they're gonna turn. Do other colors come with like different colors too? They come with a lot of colors. All right, so that nail is done. And if you want to see how I create this look with the specially for beginner nail techs or for um, nail lovers, you can definitely check it out on our previous live videos that I share with you. Really quick, simple, and easy. This is in the box. I'm going to open this one. And if you remember that I always share with you how I use, how I, like, make this tool for weaver gels using, like, five, four, five, three, or however many of the sticks that you want, just to speak, and then using a Scott tip and tip it. That's all you got to do. So I'm going to go ahead and pick like straight down 90 degree and pull, pick up some string. It's really cool. A lot of you might get a different color. I'm not sure what is coming in the box. This is I use what I got in my box. You might get a lot of things that I like. And just to unbox <coughs> to see what I got. And then wipe off on the edges and then give it a quick here. Okay. Great. And I would, if you do this, if you're using the same techniques with the same clients, you can just wipe off this, the excess weaver gels, and then you can continue doing your next nail. I would not leave the residues or the excess gels in there and then pick again because then your line will not be precise because you have um the extra gels on it and you're gonna pick more gels so it's make your line 
um, the string did not look sharp or you know precise so i would wipe it off and then continue doing it with the other nails and then uh tuck this away when you finish or like i do one hand with this and then the other hands with the others um and so this one and after is key for us like 30 seconds or 60 seconds if you doing if you don't do anything any designs at all then don't have to worry about um keying for 30 seconds key 60 seconds and then you top coat it either you top coat it or shiny top coat finish or the matte finish and then key for 60 seconds you're good to go but we're going to do some designs on it so i'm go ahead and using premium um chanfer foil gels and this will adhere my glitter so much better i'm not just like Applies and tie the nails because we are going to add it on. Okay. Huh? Oh, you wanna? We're gonna do aquarium. It's cool though. That's over cool. You can do a chamfer foil with aquariums or you can do it encapsulate with yours um glitter. And I have super cute whatever glitters you have, you can use exact the same techniques that I am showing you right now. It help it super adheres your glitter so it won't gonna like pop up or it's hard for you to control, especially when you're doing a gel polish, or you can use it with any so this is one you're doing on the top of the design but if you're using this underneath which is the velvety gel to in cap with the crystal clear or liquid and powder in cap with crystal clear so there's so many different ways you can use it so i got um the premium i hold chance for foil already so i'm gonna just pick up the uh the glitter randomly Not bad at all. Look cute. And they are staying really, really well on the nails because of the um, premium my whole channel for foy. looks really good i'm gonna go ahead and using the dual end tweezer and then give it really a wrap on it this is so cool all right this is a mystery treasure box so i'm so excited so anxious all right so now if you're happy with this you don't want anything else. You just want this. Stop right here. And then you're just using really thin coat of a condensed glue gel. So now this is the encapsulate on the top of the nails. Why is on the top of the nails? Like say, for instance, you have a client doing a liquid and powder or a gel polish. She wants to stay solid in one of her colors, which is like, for instance, she likes pink and white or she like a color acrylic, which is a nude colors or velvety gels, nude colors or um if she's using any sort of a color acrylic so she doesn't want to suck it off she can come in to do a feel if you are her nail tech so she come back two or three weeks so she's gonna get a feel but she doesn't want to like take all the nails all the way down so there's so many different ways you can do with fun nail art encapsulate so then now with this you can just do it right on the top so then you feel your nude colors your pink colors or however colors that the clients like to wear on her nails background and then she's want some designs on the top of it and you can still able to achieve encapsulate this with the condensed glue gels and no wipe top coat really good thin coat 
and you still hold the encapsulate is so long until the next time she come back to see you on the next appointment so then she, with that I have to take all her nails down fire all the want all the way all the powder down to the um closer to the nail bed you know and you have to redo it again so it's not called considered as a few unless the clients want to do a new set so you want to make sure you consult with the clients if the clients like oh nancy i love it so much but i don't want to take my nails down every single time i just want some designs on it so then you don't have to like fight all the way down you can just have a layer on the top and then this will keep in encapsulated it's so beautiful without having making the nails so bulky um i hope that makes sense because does that make sense yeah yeah okay so this is option alternative for you to do encapsulate on the top of the velvety gel a liquid can powder gel polish if your clients have already set the color she wants so you don't have to like go encapsulate and then encap with crystal clear powder and caps with crystal clear velvety gel and um that is another option so then the clients can feel so much better she can still weighing what you want without having to take it um off every single time so i am go ahead and using the condensed glue gel we are going it to move forward to the crystal trifecta three-step methods to not only encapsulate this also we are going to place some crystal on okay um this is for the clients who like to get some encapsulate and then some crystal on this is oh, this one is somehow i pull it so hard and then we're gonna load it like press it evenly okay and then we are going to using the no wipe top coat right on the top floating i'm gonna using this this is what i have on my box so i'm so excited and looking forward to see what you are going to create it with your summer box because a lot of you getting summer box and then a lot of you getting yours is velvety gel treasure box and then um gel polish treasure box i think what is this one here okay perfect so i'm not using i'm not using that one though do we have pink and then we have yellow no orange right mm -hmm. and then we have green that's it if you don't have the beads i happen to have some beads right next to me so i'm gonna add just a little bit on between the crystal and the crystals like between the joys of the crystals that's it you can add so many more and a lot of you if you are getting other shape that are going to be so cool and stunning I'm so excited because I want to do the uh, the diamond dust pixie as well. Okay, I'm happy with this. Hold on, no, not not yet. Giving a little bit quick shake right there. I'm gonna use just a little bit smaller. I want to pick just a smaller SS like four or five. See if I get some pink here. There's some pink just randomly. You don't want it, don't have to do it, but I'm gonna just add a couple on. That's it. 
make sure they are going in a good all right happy with this we'll go ahead and cure this for 60 seconds that is really cool though I got aqua, so I'm not sure which one you get, or you might get a 40 gel, you might get a gel painting, you might get a gel polish, which is, I like, oh, I hope I get gel polish in my box. But, it, it, you know, is I wasn't disappointed at all because I have a lot of the uh, elements in there. I have weaver gel, I have a lot of um, glitter. If you don't have a glitter in the box, just let me know. I can spare some with you and then i have the um neon pack and i have well the uh foy looks like aquarium foy and then i got the diamond pixies i got a whole entire new press on like tips i'm so excited i can mix another set for you uh to show you with a lot of you doing um uh, press on for your clients let me move this one. I'm going to pull it back into my my uh, containers after I'm done. So to keep it there. So, so cool and stunning. So now you not only encapsulate, also you are going to go ahead and did the crystal design as well. So I'm going to go in with the third step to keep all the crystals. If you don't have a crystal, as I say, if you don't put the crystal designs on, you don't have to go with the precision glue gels. But if you are going with crystal, I would definitely highly recommend. So this is not only keep all of the beads right here is stay nice and fresh news all the time. I'm squeeze that a little bit much if you see that. But also is prevent from getting tarnish and catching on the client's hair or your hair or anything that you're doing like your clothes. Anything that you are going to might get caught in there. So seal with the beads, around the beads, and completely seal completely the beads. And then I'm going around with the crystal. You try not to seal on the top of crystal because it's going to take you away from a beautiful shine and a cut. And you can see the reflection from that. And then seal and seal. That's it. And then we'll keep for 60 seconds. That's it. That is a box. I just is only one nails, but then we can do so many other nails. I will be coming up with some of really cute and easy, quick, simple, easy with you. And here is my box. And here we go. I have the uh I'm going to speak to you as well. And then Kawaii. I'm so excited with the Kawaii. Thank you so much, everyone, for tuning in. You can definitely simply find this box on the official website under the treasure box. So you can see the treasure box link right there for you. And let me show you the final looks for this nails. Super, super cute. So simple and super easy. Uh, thanks so much, Sprinkle. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Sheila from Facebook. Sprinkle is from YouTube. Twitch. You are on Goofy. Hello. Thank you so much. Hope you can hear it now because somehow with technical difficulty, we didn't, we completely have it mute or somehow some way, but we are back now and you can hear it from Facebook, YouTube, um, and Twitch. And thanks so much, Instagram fam. It's just something that you can come up with your trader box, uh, from trader box that I'm getting. I'm excited. I'm can't wait to see what you are getting on your box because that's going to be so cool and sunny. So I'm looking forward to see you in the next live video. You can simplify this box in, under the treasure box categories. And it has all a different an idea uh, and the different options of the box, the treasure box you would like to get. 
and you get such a good you know variety of in theme with such a good value and a good price there so hope you're really enjoying it i'm really really having fun with that we were jealous and it's a cool idea of the neon theme for this summer uh sheila this is the trigger box so i just got my summer trigger box i opened it but no the mother's day box we did it yesterday we did it yesterday the box um for may box and then tomorrow is gonna be the new box is launching for the june sub box so if you are sub the um the box so tomorrow the sub box is gonna be so cool and stunning though i'm looking forward to unboxing the sub box in june sub box tomorrow or day after tomorrow for you so you can see what you are going to get and but the trigger box is different like everybody every trigger box is totally different with a lot of different contents in there a lot of different elements in there so you will never get bored you never go wrong with any of the box i was like i just come up with something cute when seeing i got the box i hope you like it because i really like hmm, that does look really cool it's not bad at all so using it what i got so, so i opened my uh crystal already but then this is a few of them i pour some in here it was uh the the back is still open but there's some in here and then it's full so if if i pull everything in here the whole pack is gonna fill up the tray but i don't want the tray to be overflow when i'm doing crystal design so i just get quick few of them out in the meantime we're doing a live tutorial so here is a look yes sheila so if you haven't get chance did you get the maze box it's a maze box then today's the last day if you haven't get the maze box then today's the last day so here's a, some tip and trick you can do if you love the box the may box this is a treasure box so different and a lot of you might get the trailer box different from what i got so i'm so excited that's why i can't wait to share because it's the best thing about the trailer box if you want surprise you want to so excited to see what you are going to get in your theme treasure boxes always make you excited but you want to get something is more like sets like what you are getting like say if you get glitter you get gel polish you get a and you get b and you get c then you get sub box so you get an idea of what you are going to get so um but you you are want something is really cool really fun and in the theme um chaser box always like get me excited as well because i don't know what i'm getting so it's always in a theme so if you want like you don't care for summer box you don't care for like velvety gel box you don't care for gel polish box you don't care for um acrylics box and get the um sub box i mean then get the um besides the box and you know what it but if you don't want to know then you get the classic cheddar boxes have like variety of cool things in there so it's really excited so i just want to go with summer you can see what's up with the summer box so it's had a lot of cool like vibrance theme and stuff like that so i'm excited and i kind of like this the weaver gels it came out it's really good and you can do it any colors it doesn't have to be on this color background you can do it in yellow you can if you're doing yellows and the swap the different colors they can do blue purple and pink so on the background of yellows like that's what i'm going to do with this if i do this i'm going to do this this um pink purple and blues on the top of yellow so it's really pop so it's really like i like it a lot so i'm going to create the set for myself on my size so then that way i can able to keep it for me yeah so today's the last day for sub the box but this one the treasure box are totally different so if you love treasure box uh and the summer theme or like velvety gels or gel polish gel polish is really cool because you can pick the color like say if i want beige um sub box i just get the beige sub box and you get the like not only the colors that you want for sure guarantee come in but a lot of other related to the gel palace and the nail art that is complements your um your designs on the box so whatever box you pick you will never go wrong with this or velvety gel is really cool it's such a great value you pick the colors that you want and then the nail art and everything like accessories with your velvety gel is also like really like support you know when you're getting the color as well 
so here's the final looks for the designs i hope you'll like it and enjoying it really cool quick and simple and easy so if you have any question regarding to the um products or if you haven't find couldn't find any of the link for your certain products that you are looking for or you're watching a lot of our video or our ba brand ambassador is uh, on their live videos on or at or their post, if you couldn't find it, don't hesitate to DM us. Our team will be so happy to send you a link. And for the products or any question you might have, any questions regarding to the order or shipping, please feel free to email us at info at glitzestestinsus.com. We'll be so happy to assist you as soon as possible. And thank you, thank you. And for is a great things that um, uh, one of the really good news that we're all going to announce and as soon as you're going to see the post and we're looking for new brand ambassadors so if you know your friends whoever love in the nail arts really passionate about what they're doing you love anything with the nail art and would like to like you know um get more into the nail industries and want to share a lot of different cool techniques and your knowledge and you are like on social medias and you was like active on social media and any platform can be TikTok, youtube uh, facebook and instagram please send them to our way because we'll love to have them joys and thank you so much everyone for tuning in today i'm looking forward to see you in the next live video in the meantime please take good care of yourself and be safe out there, okay? I'm looking forward to see you in the next live video. Thank you, everyone. Bye.